Hi friends, good morning. So today is gonna be a good old fashioned day in the life of a pregnant stay at home mom. This video will be going up after the gender reveal. It's a girl. Oh my gosh, we are still, so in like, in the time that I'm filming this, we found out, it's today Tuesday, my lips are so dry. We found out like three, four days ago that I was a girl. And we have just been on cloud nine. I will do like a very quick, like almost like drive by <laughs> of some of the cute clothes that we've already got, you know, in like the three days that we've known it's a girl, we already have like a mountain, like quite the mountain of girl clothes. Um, but I'm gonna do a separate like haul for all that stuff. Cause like, it's so freaking cute. And I am going to, you better believe, indulge like every single moment of this entire pregnancy and like <laughs> all the girl things all the girl thing is it's gonna be the most annoying disclaimer for like the rest of my the videos people. it's gonna be annoying but i don't care yeah. i'm gonna live my best people. girl mom life where are you going did you that stays here honey bunny i had to put you down my arms are like so tired um okay so here's what here's what here's what here's the plan um, I'm going to, I'm feeling like very pregnant this morning. Um, I am going to make the bed and then we're going to get everyone ready for school, right? Today is a school day. Hugo has school. So let's make, let's make the bed, which I should just say, um, I am so happy with the throw pillows. I think I mentioned that before. Although I will say the, um, cover for this pillow, this is like the, um, matching duvet, Pillow sham, the sham, <laughs> a strange word. The pillow sham is in the laundry because I have like a weird green stain on it. Oh my gosh, guys, I feel like this is the first morning where like this early, it's like not even 8 a.m., I look pregnant. I like look super pregnant. I mean, I love it, but I don't know if it's just like a bloated thing or it does feel though like it's like pregnant belly and not bloating. Did your baby go in there? There's a little girl. Whew, a little out of breath, but we're home from dropping Hugo off at school. He um, did not really want to go today, but I think it's just cause like any time, any Blaze, Blaze is in the truck bins, honey. Anytime we have a long weekend or something, I feel like it always kind of messes with, you know, like the ease of our schedule and stuff. Oh, also, I got a haircut yesterday. Yeah, it was yesterday. Oh my goodness. I, I honestly like don't love it. I don't know if it's just like, yeah, I think it's too short. I could like, I don't feel like I had said this short when I was like explaining how short I wanted it. Like you guys know my hair was like down to here, and I'm pretty sure I said that I wanted it cut to here. Oh well. Like, here's the thing. I don't love like I had said like angles too and there's a little bit of angles in it but like it just seems very like chopped to me um but my hair grows quickly we all know like the frequency at which I get haircuts so at least I can let it like grow out a bit and I think it will like grow out I think it will grow out nicely but it's like a little too short for me right now so We'll see. I can put, I can still put it up in a bun, which is good. But yeah, that was like, that was yesterday. Um, all right. Anyway, I am going to take a breath. So out of breath. And then I'm going to try to get some work on my computer done. This is like so not focusing. Come on. Um, I'm going to try to get some work done on my computer. All your dino truck supercharged cars, honey, are in the bin do a quick little walk by of these two bags here so my mom got baby girl a couple cute things by a couple i mean like a couple bags of cute things and um i'm gonna film it all in a separate video because it just like needs to be shown it's so adorable but i'll show this cute little hippo can you even hippos were my favorite animal when i was little and like it's a girl hippo and look at this it's a I also um, did buy 
a onesie from Target that says Little Sister on it. So, like, if it says Little Sister on it, you can almost bet me. You can almost bet that I will definitely buy it. <laughs> so, there you go. I also wanted to open up this box because my best friend's daughter is turning one in a few days and her birthday party is this weekend, which is so exciting. And um, this is one of her presents. I'm waiting on one more present for her. Let's see you there. Oh my gosh, how cute is this? Look. We're also like so excited that her daughter and like my daughter will be pretty close in age. They'll be about 18 months apart. And you can put me in how cute is that? This is the Learn and Discover Pretty Party Playset. Have you ever seen something so cute before? It says, who wants some lemonade? Oh my unis. And it comes with these like cute little treats. I just thought it was the cutest thing ever. So I got her this. Um, I also ordered her this like cute VTech. Um, it looks like, you know, like those horses, the like old fashioned ones that they don't like go anywhere. Maybe it's a ride-on. I'm not sure. It's like a cute unicorn, like a VTech unicorn that you can sit on. I don't know if it like, you can scoot it. You probably can. I feel like a lot of the toys nowadays aren't stationary. Like you can move it. It's either stationary or not. <laughs> but let me show you the other things I got. What are these cute blocks? These are the mega blocks. My boys have these, but um, this one just has like cute purple and pink blocks that I thought was so fun. And then I picked her up some pajamas. Um, they're still in the plastic because like I have kids and I'm not about to like have these just out and about. I don't want them to get like stained or anything. Got this cute one. I don't know if you can tell, but it's um, like a, a pretty mint green. And then this pretty purple color. This little, this, um, they're all Burt's Bees. I don't know if I mentioned that. They're 18 months. And this one has teapots on it. So cute. And then this pretty floral one so adorbs i have to wrap all this stuff before saturday which is like easier said than done all right hey friends we're home we um the boys had a good gym class and then we stopped off at mcdonald's on the way home the boys love the mcdonald's apple slices because they don't have any skins on them. They love that. And uh, I ate their french fries. So like win-win all around. Oh, and they got like cute little, um, cute little toys. So anyway, um, now we're home and the boys are watching a little bounce patrol. And I am feeling okay right now, which is good because right before Theodore and I left to go pick up Hugo, I was feeling super nosh. And, um, like, really not good. So, I'm happy that I'm feeling good now. Uh, I'm going to try to just, like, get as much stuff done as I can. Like, dishes and tidying while I'm still feeling good. Um, and it's, like, a little after 2.30 now. So, here's to hoping. Um, but I want to show you some, like, already. I wanted to, I wanted to, I want to film. Like, going through the boys' bins and stuff. And, like, donating a bunch of stuff. Or giving it to friends and family. Um, but yesterday, I, had, like, did an impromptu really quick, like, going through the bins. Um, to put some stuff aside for my sister-in-law. Who has boys who, um, like, could use some of the boys' old clothes if they want. So, I'll turn the camera around. So, this is just a small bit of stuff that I like quickly went through the bins and pulled out. It's so wild, like going through the clothing bins and like seeing stuff that you totally forgot about, but that brings back so many memories. And then, I mean, there's also stuff that like the boys never wore, you know, like either one of them. I don't think either one of the boys ever wore this shirt. Like, I don't know seasonally if it didn't line up or what, but it's just, it's wild to see. Anyway, there's lots of clothes in here that she can go through. I don't know if seasonally everything will be super appropriate, but at least there's options. But yeah, it's like, I, gosh, I remember Hugo wearing this. Like, I remember when he was like nine months old wearing that. Ah, it's like so emotional. Just walked into the chair. Um, hi guys, so it's 4.40 and I am in the middle of making the boys' dinner. 
but I wanted to finish this vlog out here. I am starting to feel like the night nausea creep in. Luckily, it isn't as bad as yesterday. Yesterday was really bad. Um, so I'm gonna have a little snack. By little snack, I mean like meal. Um, and continue putting the boys' dinners together and just pray that the rest of the night, at least while the boys are awake, is fine. And then if I, like, once the boys are asleep, I'm sure Jeff will be home pretty soon thereafter and then I can just like go lay down. But um, yeah, thanks for hanging out with me today. It felt nice vlogging and um, see y'all really soon.